tried to make this video before, but I made it way too long, so I'm going to try to get through it a little faster this time. Um, as you guys know, most of you know, I went to the NASCAR races this weekend. Had a lot of fun, had a lot of drink. Um, it was awesome. I have my tickets right here. You can see, this is Sunday, uh, Saturday, and Friday. And obviously, Sunday is the most expensive at... 205.61 plus 14.39 tax, but free food, free drinks, everything. It was awesome. So I did. Um, I am gonna post some pictures and some a video right now. So now that you guys saw the picture and video, um, pictures and video, um, it was a lot of fun. I had a lot of fun. It was really awesome. So it was a great weekend. I will show you a bunch of stuff I got. First, let's go through the eh, stuff that I got. Complimentary. I do have. I got three cans of Camel Snooze, the Mellow, the Robust, and the Frost. Uh, I have a can of the Winter Chill um, in my freezer, so I will do a review on all four of these at once. And you can see these three cans say complimentary courtesy of Camel. So, oops, I dropped it. So I will do a review on all three of these at once, and that will be a lot of fun. Um, I did also get a can of Red Man. I just cracked it last night. Um, I will do a review on this as well, or can, a bag of Red Man Chew. So I will do a review on this coming up soon. Now, for the, a lot of the cool stuff I got. First, let's go through. I got a bunch of Longhorn. Free samples. It's one long cut mint, two long cut winter greens, and one fine cut natural that one of my friends, you know, went in there and just told me to give them whatever. So he got that for me. For me. Awesome. Um, I got a lot of skull wintergreen. There's three regular cans and three um, sample cans. The regular cans are, um, you know, I did get them for a dollar each. Um, so that was pretty cool and I will um, so that's that I did get Skull Citrus heard it was really good from Chris Super Express it so I'm gonna try that out I got some Skull Mint sample can and a regular can I have a regular another regular can somewhere because I bought two of them for a dollar each and I can't find it oh you know what I found it so I will do a review on that as well. I'll do a review on all this stuff. So, And then I got a can of Skull Straight. Um, I tried it. They gave me a little sample. It was pretty good. It was, you know. So I'll pack it. Fuck, I'm dropping shit everywhere. And if I can't find it, I'm going to be pissed. So, I will pack a lip of this real quick. And I will continue with the shit I got in a minute here. So, all right, 
back to the more stuff I got. I was sitting in my knife for advantage mud jugs. So, more stuff I got. I got some grizzly snuff. Got some grizzly straight. I won't cut straight. And I got some finally Copenhagen black. Yeah. Finally found it. Um, all this can not cracked. I did try it. The guy from Skull Booth let me try it. He had some on him. I gave him a can of general just to be a nice guy. Um, general loose, uncracked can. So he was happy with that. So I got a lot of really cool shit. Had a lot of fun. Um, my racer won his fifth championship. Jimmy Johnson. Hell yeah. I even got like a cool little thing here. From Bank of America. We're giving these shits out. Um, pretty cool stuff. So I had a lot of fun. Um, the races are awesome every year. I really like them. I have a lot of fun every year. And as you can see, I am a Chevy guy. Chevrolet. So, and I like Hendrix Motorsports. I have a Hendrix hat somewhere. So it's really cool stuff. But uh, all the freaking dip I got, the $1 cans were awesome. However, the sucky thing about it was they didn't have a lot of variety. They only had long cut wintergreen, long cut mint, long cut straight, um, fine cut wintergreen, wintergreen pouches, straight pouches, and mint pouches. That's it. That's all you could buy for $1. Um, but, I mean, $1. Come on. The Swedish match guy was supposed to be there. I have a little thing that says, here, one of the booths. I don't know if you can see this. One of the booth says, Swedish match. See it? However, what they did was, um, the Longhorn booth, since it's owned by Pinkerton, which is owned by Swedish match, um, was there, and the Swedish match rep was supposed to be there with them. Never saw them. Um, I told the guys to tell me when they saw them. They never saw them. So, I never got to talk to them, which I really wanted to. Oh, well. So, like I said, I will be doing a review on all this stuff. Um, the things I did not buy at the race, um, I had to pay, you know, a little more money for, was my Grizzly Snuff, Grizzly Straight, Coat Black, Skull Citrus, and my Red Man. And the Red Man, I'm kind of pissed I paid so much about for it. I paid nine bucks for it, but that's about the price it goes for down here. The other ones, the Grizzlies, I paid three bucks and these two, the Coat Black and the Skull Citrus, I paid five bucks for. But I found it down, kind of in the country down south. Um, so yeah, races are awesome. If you've never been to a race, go. Next year, they will have a Swedish match at Booth, supposedly, is what I was told, um, for the races. That would be really cool. Um, so they will be promoting... They said they're going to promote mostly general stuff, general snooze. So that'll be a lot of fun, you know, free samples. It sucks that they can't give free samples like they used to. They used to give, um, you know, as many samples as you want. Now they can only give you one can a day. So I got one can a day from Skull and Longhorn and Camel. Um, and I got some cans from, you know, my cousin that dips actually, but he gave it to me. And... One other guy that goes, um, that went with us. Tried to get my dad to go in there with me, but he only went to the camel thing with me. He didn't want to go into the skull or longhorn. So he kind of screwed me over and didn't give me any. So I'm just super excited. Jimmy Johnson won. Five-time champion. Five times. Um, badass. Let's see if we can go for six next year. Um, and it's not just five times. It's five times consecutive. He's won the last five championships. It was an awesome race. Um, back and forth points, back and forth, back and forth, and Jimmy Johnson ended the race second, um, and got the points. I believe he led by like 41 points at the end, so it was a lot of fun. Um, Darcy, if, you, if you're watching this, I brought my mud jug, I brought the smud jug to the race. Everyone asked me about it. People were saying they wanted to get it for their husbands, for themselves. They don't like having styrofoam bottles and, and 
you know, water bottles around everywhere. So, um, I referred them to mudjug.com. Hopefully, you get a lot of purchases um, from that. Um, they were all looking for Christmas presents and stuff like that. So, I'm hoping you get some purchases from that. Um, I was happy to promote it. A lot of people were asking what the hell it was. And I showed them all the cool features, how it doesn't spill, and how you can, you know, it's weighted. So, I promoted a little bit for you. And I kind of promoted a little bit of snooze, too, to the to the dip guys and stuff. And a lot of people were, were, were very um, accepting to the knowledge. Um, a, one guy in the skull booth was telling all the other skull guys, this guy knows everything about tobacco. Ask him questions and he'll tell you answers and blah, 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 blah. And I pride myself in knowing, you know, quite a bit. I research a lot on tobacco and stuff like that. So, um, you know, it was really cool. And I like to talk to the guys just to talk about shit. So, had a lot of fun. Um, go to a NASCAR race if you haven't been. Even if you have to get the, you know, cheap seats. Um, as you can tell, I had a box seat Champions Club. Um, I had these for about four years now. Um, before that, I was in, you know, I had pit seats and I've had grandstand seats and stuff like that. But these seats are the best. Um, the free food, free drinks, just you drink and eat all freaking day. And you, you definitely get your money's worth. So it's a lot of fun. Um, this video is actually not as long as the other one. So I'm happy about that. So I think I'm going to end it right here. Um, I think that's all I wanted to show you guys really. So you guys will check out those clips that are in the beginning there. And... Keep on dipping, keep on snoozing, keep on using smokeless, and have a good time, guys. I had a great weekend. Hope you guys had a fucking amazing weekend. Um, it was good. Oh, one other thing I wanted to show you guys. I got this stuff from a, a guy on the snooze on forum. I guess he doesn't dip anymore. He decided to send me, send me a bunch of these $1 off cans of Timberwolf. Um, a couple more $1 off. Amber Wolf and one 75 cents off a red seal so it was really cool I got a bunch of these so I can go get some timber wolf and some red seal you know people are awesome send to me for free so talking to these guys about the the skull snooze and surprise surprise skull is going to re-release their snooze. Um, I don't know if it's going to be the same flavors. They could not disclose that to me. But the flavors they had before, I believe, was uh, cinnamon and some like tobacco -y flavor. And I believe they had wintergreen. They had, they had three flavors at one time and they had two flavors at a different time because they've released it a couple times. Um, so they're going to re-release re it this time. Um, it is going to be a pouch and it is going to be spit-free regular snooze. So look out for that, guys. Let me know if you can find it. Um, I'm looking to try it once they release it. So that's about it, guys. I'll see you next time. Um, I will be coming out with some reviews soon on all the shit I got. So until next time, guys, peace out.